tried to open up the, the box. Oh. <laughs> and see what's inside. Can, can the camera zoom in? Hello guys, it's me, Mr. D. Fang. So Valentine's Day is just around the corner. And one of the hardest things for couples to do is to buy the perfect gift for the other person, whether it's girlfriend, boyfriend, husband, or wife. It's really hard to pick the perfect gift and surprise the other person. Sometimes you might get it right, but sometimes you're gonna get it wrong. I figure a better way of buying a gift is not to think of what the other person wants, but instead trying to suggest and convince them that what you bought is exactly what they want to have. Subconscious is motivated by emotion, right? Not reason. We need to find You are trying to suggest to them this is the exact gift that they want. Once you've got the gift, it's going to be 100% match. How am I going to do it? First of all, I'm going to go to a store nearby and pick an item. So we're at outside Rite Aid right now. Um, the reason I picked Rite Aid is because it has a lot of variety of different things. Uh, this is not going to be like their dream gift, but it's going to be something that they like, hopefully. And hopefully I'll be able to convince them this is exactly what they like. Yeah, gift card could work, but like I don't, I don't know the person, so it'd be weird. Chips might be great. People like to eat chips, uh, but I don't know. I know what I'm getting, so I'm gonna ask the camera to stop because I don't want to show you the item yet. Sir? I'm not exactly sure if this is gonna work, um, but we'll see. Cashier number one. All right, so now that we've got our gift, what we have to do is to find someone that I think I can convince them this is exactly what they want to have. And that's the hard part, right? I think maybe I should get, get it for someone that's more lighthearted. Uh, that lady right there, I think she could work, but I'm not exactly sure. All right, so you see that, you see that couple over there? I think they're really laid back, so I'm going to go ask for them. I don't know if that's going to work, but we're going to give it a try. Excuse me, do you have, do you have one second now? Is that, is that okay? So, um, I know it, it sounds really strange, right? So, uh, since Valentine's is coming, I think the hardest thing is to pick the perfect gift for the significant other. In, in this case, I think it would be this lady right here next to you, right? So, here I have a gift an item, right? It's not going to be something that's like your dream thing that you want to have or something like that, but it's going to be something that you like, right? So I want you to just, uh, actually you can hold on to it, don't open it, but just hold on to it, just kind of gauge how heavy it is, right? I mean, it doesn't tell you much, but, but think of the color and just kind of what it reminds you and, you know, the, the size doesn't matter. Here's the thing, right? You think this box is huge, it doesn't mean the thing inside is huge. It could be something that's small. I mean, it's up to you, but whatever you want to have, uh, it's going to be sweet and nice, up to you. What is it? I think I like chocolate. Chocolate. Yeah. Try to open up the, the box. Oh. <laughs> and see what's inside. Can, can the camera zoom in? That's actually funny. It's chocolate. <laughs> it's two chocolates too. Mm -hmm. Nice. That's for you guys. Oh my god, thank you so much. That's Did you, like you, you didn't feel like you were convinced just by the shape of the box and the things that I say that you make you think of chocolate? I actually thought it was chocolate. I, I could have sworn, like, it looks like something that would like, have chocolate. Okay, uh, you can't keep the box, but the chocolates are for you guys, so. <laughs> Thank you. you. Yeah, thank Happy you so Valentine's, Happy, well, I mean, it's two weeks, but. I, somebody, a stranger is able to kind of give you a gift that like you actually were thinking of. I actually thought it kind of surprising. I, I don't understand how you would have known it could have been chocolate. Kind of surprising. Yeah. That was good. I'm um, really glad that the person thought of chocolate. So I got a couple of chocolates inside, so now there's no more. Obviously, I've gave out to that guy. Um, he's actually really thankful of me giving him chocolates, although it's, they're not that expensive, just a couple of dollars. It just goes to show that it's not the amount of money that you spend on the gift, but what that person wants at that exact time. Yeah, did you guys catch how I was able to convince that person that he wanted chocolate? If not, try to rewatch that video and try to figure it out. What was the line? Life is a box full of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. Sometimes it might just be a box of chocolates.
Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, I guess I should tell you guys to subscribe, like, and comment this video. But if you don't, that's fine too. Uh, but you should because it's Valentine's Day. Take care, guys. Happy Valentine's Day, guys. <laughs>